how high can holo chain chain link 0x trx tron where how high can these coins go welcome back guys it's crypto Rocko here and in today's video i'll be talking about some of the coins that we've been trading and how high they can go so if you guys have been following me guys you know i've been talking about z coin um Holo chain massively. I've been talking about Holo chain for a while. Um, Chainlink, Neo, V chain. I've been talking about these coins for a while, guys. So I'll be talking about some of my targets. I mean, if you bought when I bought, guys, um, it was 019. Yeah, I bought it again. It is really, really good profit. Let me see how much profit I'm in. I think I got in around here actually. Um, it's almost like 2x guys so if you're in this trade guys you should be sitting on some good profits I'll be talking about some targets so guys my initial target was previous highs and we shattered that guys you can see with one big candle guys we broke through it it's difficult on um, on the Binance chart, it's not very clear. You can see, guys, we just broke through that previous high resistance, and we kept going higher up. So that was my previous um, resistance, guys, and we broke through that. My next one was um, this level, guys, the one, um, the one two seven two level. When you break higher up, that's usually the target level that you look out for. If you look at previously when we did this in in our last breakout, we hit the one six one eight level, and that is my final target. And we went very close to. I don't know if you can say we've touched it, but we went very close to it, and it also matches the two one six eight. Um, extension from the previous run as well so that that was my those were my targets guys we we came very close to this target and um, so what are we looking for now holo chain needs to hold this level if it can stay above this level then i might even add to my position if it can hold and form like a basing pattern i mean it could i don't want to say but we could even potentially see that sort of level um I'm not getting too excited now because it has like you've seen guys again it's difficult guys when in technical analysis some sometimes when it starts running a technical analysis might say oh it's going down but guys it, if it decides to run it will just keep on going we've seen it in bitcoin the fifth wave guys it, some people said it won't go up after 12000 it just carried on um so yeah it, it could carry on up to there but there's going to be a pullback cuz n nothing just keeps going up and up forever um so that was my initial targets guys and we hit, we almost hit that level what i'm looking for holo chain now is staying above this level so so those are some things I'm looking at for Holo Chain. Let's look at TRX, guys. TRX is slightly simpler, guys. Uh, for me, the main target is the 786 level and previous highs around there. We need to stay above that level uh, the previous highs. You should always target previous highs uh, whenever you open your chart. If you're not, um, that was a trade we took. You can see that was a really nice trade. Um, yes, guys. So when whenever you... Um, trade just look for previous highs we've we're at we've got some resistance around here i've drawn that resistance line if we can get above there then we should be looking at that level and it's also the 786 fib uh, target from previous and people say fibonacci doesn't work but you can see that this was drawn um a while back and it hit that 786 level perfectly so fibonacci's do work if you know how to use it so that's sort of my target let's just wait for these previous highs and if we can break above it you can see uh, the 1618 is kind of that um, those highs so we could potentially target those but for now let's see if we can get to uh, hit that target and we can stay above this resistance line and hit that target one thing to always keep in mind guys i always um, tweet about this i am in a fairly big position in litecoin um, i have tweeted about this and one of the you could go watch this video actually I talk about some of the three things I'm looking um, and why I'm buying it I talk about technical analysis and fundamental analysis as well and one thing I talk about is B Bitcoin needs to do well and a, a really good thing is that although that there's been some negative news about ET the ETF uh, being delayed Bitcoin still hasn't dropped massively so when it's not dropping in negative news we can only take it as positives it's still staying above this level as long as Bitcoin stay above this level I'll still be bullish guys so th those are just my targets guys I'll talk about two more coins um, 
Neo is a coin that I'm looking at guys I'm not that bullish yet it's, it's still sideways range I'm just hoping that it breaks out uh, ontology is looking slightly better it's at the 50% level hopefully ontology sees some actions and kind of break this previous highs and um, then ontology you could look for that target one more coin that I'd like to talk to you about is chain link chain link is done what holochain is doing now where by that I mean breaking through previous highs and guys look at how beautiful this chart is I've tweeted about this few times is this the best looking chart in crypto and then um, targets for that was again I talked to a 1272 you can see chain link hit that level so our next target would be this if we can hold these moving averages that was a trade I took if you if, if we can stay above this level I'd say maybe around that level and this level and above the moving averages we can potentially see 168 that's another coin that I'm really looking at. So thank you very much, guys. Oh, sorry, I would like to look at VTrain as well. I did talk about VTrain. I did take a VTrain trade. VTrain is getting some resistance. Oh, I've done my um, analysis on my other trading view account. So I haven't got my targets on here. Apologies, guys. I'm just going to quickly do it. So VTrain, guys, you can see um, I haven't done the Fib Fibonacci's correctly, I think can see if you don't draw it correctly it does match so it needs to get above this level it's quite easy to see if we can get above this level I'd be looking at kind of the 50% level for V chain but it, it looks a bit extended if it can if it can sideways consolidate form like a bull, fa bull flag or like a nice pullback we can potentially see that level so that is what I'm looking at for V chain so thank you very much guys if you guys have uh, don't follow me on Twitter make sure you give me a follow and watch my videos guys I talk about my trades I, I try to be really transparent not, not a lot of um, YouTubers or people on Twitter share their trades. I'm very transparent. I'm not trying to sell you a course. I'm just being honest with my trades. And hopefully, even if you learn one thing from me, I'd be really happy. So thank you very much, guys. I hope you um, are enjoying the videos. And if you do enjoy it, smash that like button, subscribe to my channel. And also, guys, if you want to win $250 worth of XRP, guys, uh, subscribe to my channel and make sure you turn on the notification button to win $250 worth of XRP um, in my next giveaway also guys if you want any if you have any questions guys comment below and also email me guys if you want any mentoring trading tips or anything guys or if you have any sort of questions uh, just email me guys and I'll try and help you out so thank you very much guys smash that like button subscribe to my channel and I'll see you guys soon with another great video thank you very much